hello and welcome to asan tutorials in this video i will show you how to combine all the worksheets of current workbook in this workbook i am having three stocks historical data and every day new rows of data will be added to the existing data so for that purpose i will convert this to table to select all the data control a to convert to table control t and i will rename the tables to the stock name stock symbol now this is time to combine all of them go to data get data from other sources blank query click on advanced editor and in the place of this double quote type excel dot current workbook now it shows the three tables and the name of the tables and click on expand button to see all the data uh, i do not want this as prefix so uncheck this here we are having all the data so now we have to change the data type uh, this columns and as well as this one they all are decimal and this one having letter m i will convert this to text this is already text and this is the date column so we can put in a name the one is okay for me and close and load uh, so here we are having uh, 1503 rows of data and if we check we uh, have all these tables as well as the uh, worksheet for so we do not uh, need the current the data where all the data are there so if queries and connections are not visible to you go to data click on queries and connection and then hover your mouse click on edit here we have to filter out so uncheck the query one close and load this time we have 1502 rows of data and that is the same three tables if we add any new table that will be added uh, automatically in the combined data so let's check just as test so i will copy some data control c and i will convert it to table test table now if i refresh this one there will be more data 22 rows of data so if we check here we have the test as well so please don't forget to subscribe and share the video if that was helpful to you thank you for viewing the video